But guess what? Even in the Eden, that tree was Jesus. Because it is him. He said, what is eternal life? It's to know God. And the one you have sent, Jesus Christ. So the life in the tree was not the tree. It was Jesus. And can I take it further? Even the Adam was Jesus. Because Adam is the prototype of human form that failed. That prophesying the, human, the God form project that will succeed. The first Adam, Adam failed in a garden. The last Adam is not Adam. the second Adam. Because if you say it's the second Adam, you are saying there is a third, you say there is a the fourth, and say there is a fifth. But Jesus is not the second Adam. He is the last. Because he is the God's project that function. Because for God to do any project, and man accept it, men have to fail in their project. That's why he put an Adam of a man that he created from the dust so that that project we fail so that his project he said no one have ever ascended in heaven unless the one who descended from heaven Jesus was born on earth but he came from heaven because he's God's project to save man's project that failed that's why laws existed because life can exist if there is no laws and what were the laws paying you do and you die and what life says eat and live because even in the garden, it's all about Jesus. My life, it's all about Jesus. Your life, it's all about Jesus. That's why, if you cry that you don't have a car, that you're not achieving, you are messing up with the cross. Jesus didn't die for a car. Didn't God didn't Jesus didn't die for a career? Jesus did. Oh, am I talking to some people? When you reduce Jesus, when you reduce Jesus on an achievement on earth, you have failed on the cross. Because you don't need to achieve something to become successful. We are more than conquerors. The day we believed in him, we are more than conquerors. I don't know those people who have been conquerors. We are more than them. The day we are born again. You have nothing to prove to anyone. You have Amato Sabadaba, including God. You have nothing to prove to God. This is the good news that we preach. Am I talking to somebody? A gullion, a gullion, a gullion. Jesus is our savior. Yes, no, no, Jesus, but Jesus is our message. I love Jesus. You know, when he chose me, he had no criteria to choose me. When I decided to follow him, I put there no criteria for me to follow him. I will follow Jesus. In the morning, I will follow Jesus. In the night, I will follow Jesus. When my life is not going well, I will follow Jesus. I'm not a teacher of university. I'm a preacher of the good news. Jesus is our message. Yes, we but we even in the garden. Let's, let me ask you a question. The first Adam failed in the garden. The last Adam succeeded in the garden. One garden was Eden. Adam failed in the garden of Eden. But last Adam succeeded in the Gethsemane garden. Because all of them was fighting one thing. The will of God. In Eden the will was do not eat but eat. But in the, in the garden, in the Gethsemane garden, it was drink or do not drink. Because where food will kill you, drinks will give life. They failed by fruits. We received the new covenant by a drink. He said, do this. Do this as long as you remember me. Do this. Why was that? Drink on the... <laughs> you know, Jesus is everywhere. Okay, Adam failed. Number one, God killed an animal to cover the shame of Adam. But that animal was Jesus. He's the Lamb of God, slain for our salvation. Because they were still under the law, he had to cover them. But we are under grace, he had to take it away. He says, he passed where John the Baptist was preaching. And John said, this is the Lamb of God, who is not here to cover, but to take away sin. Because the season, the hour, the year where God have given mercy was beginning. But he still, the image that the animal was providing. But you say, okay, that animal died. But what about the skin? 
Paul said, where Christ? Christ has a clothes. Because Jesus, it is the skin of that animal. That's my Jesus. He's everywhere and everyhow. 